Jesus, it's really been over six months since I've uploaded a proper video on this channel, huh? I'm sure there's a number of you that are wondering where in the world I've been and what I've been doing. And well, the answer lies on my channel's live tab. That's basically where my contents live for quite a while now. But I know most of my subscribers don't really care about those streams and that's understandable. That's mainly why I figured I should make a proper video explaining where my headspace has been for the past while to help clear some things up. Keep in mind that even though this video is scripted, I'm writing this video very off the cuff just as a way to spill my thoughts out onto a Google Doc. So this may come off very unorganized. Apologies in advance for that. So, many of you may not know this, but the last video I posted on this channel that was supposed to celebrate seven years of everything wrong with Steven Universe was delayed because of the last stages of a fairly taxing family emergency. Said family emergency lasted for basically most of 2023 and ended not so well. 2023 was the year for me that somehow ended up being the most stressful and mentally draining, perhaps even mentally scarring, but also ended up being one of my best in terms of progress in my personal life. I did things last year that I wouldn't have even dreamed of doing in 2020, but it came at the cost of my productivity on this channel. Between new responsibilities piling up, the remnants of 2023 still being fresh on my mind, and the time commitment of other parts of my life, I haven't been left with much energy to do much on YouTube outside of streaming. Combine that with the fact that my brain tends to operate like an idea factory, supplying me with a ton of potential video ideas, with the caveat of me lacking any motivation or energy to even attempt doing them, and you have a recipe for a stagnant channel. I mean, why put time and effort into something new when it could potentially bomb horribly? Why not put that time into something you know will work, like everything wrong with Steven Universe? And yeah, you might think that's a perfectly reasonable idea. Why not just get back to everything wrong with Steven Universe? Seems to solve that problem pretty efficiently, right? There's two major problems with that. One small and one pretty big. The small issue is the sheer time commitment it takes to make one season of everything wrong with. Every week, me and my co-writer have to be available one day to write a script that varies in length depending on the episode. I then have to voice it, edit it, upload it, etc. And despite me being more efficient in this process than ever before, it's still a lot lot when I have to consider slotting it in with everything else going on in my life. Most days I just feel like laying down or streaming when I finish up. Convincing my brain to go into video mode during those periods, well, some days you'd be better off convincing hell to freeze over. But honestly, this has a simple solution too. I could just drop the weekly schedule for everything wrong with and just say they'll release when they're ready. And I've considered that, several times in fact. But here's the big issue. And it's one that some of you may have seen coming, considering how long I've been doing this. I'm not sure if I want to keep doing everything wrong with Steven Universe. It's weird to actually write, and I'm sure it'll be even weirder to say out loud, but I've been wrestling with it for a bit now. As I sit and watch the YouTube landscape change month by month, as I see all of these different creators tackle media criticism and the ways both them and myself go about things, I'm starting to think there's been a bit of a disconnect with what people think everything wrong with is and what I want it to be. I mean, the name literally is everything wrong with. I shouldn't be surprised if people think I'm very hostile towards the thing I'm talking about. Not to mention the format feels kind of outdated in a sense. There's only so far you can take funny one-liner about thing that happens followed by the same repeated ding sound effect before it starts to get stale. And frankly, I think it already got stale long before I even jumped in on it. And yes, I know. I feel like I bring enough different to the table that makes my Everything Wrong With series stand out compared to others. Hell, some of my Everything Wrong With, like the new Lars and Bismuth, saw unprecedented numbers purely because they were so different from everything else I'd done but they're still limited by the format. I don't feel like I can be as creative or as unique if I stay in this everything wrong with bubble. Combine that with just how much of a stigma everything wrong with seems to have nowadays, and I don't know, I just feel like I need to change it up somehow. But too many changes might start to feel alienating. Would it even really be everything wrong with anymore? You might disagree, but in my eyes, I don't think so. I'm gonna be entirely honest here, even if it hurts me to say. I think everything wrong with is a format I need to try and move on from. And no matter what I do or what changes I bring to it, nothing's really going to change that. And change is what I desperately need right now. 
I tried something different back in 2022, that Save the Light video where I played the game with only Steven. I think it really says something when that video stands as the most viewed video on my channel, currently at 1.2 million views. I took a gamble on something different that I wanted to do with a genre on YouTube that I adored and wanted to contribute to myself, and it paid off immensely. To me, this video's success is a sign. It's YouTube giving me an indication on what direction would best benefit me and my channel, and I'm seeing less and less of a reason not to follow it and see what happens. So, what does this mean for this channel? For right now, everything wrong with Steven Universe is indefinitely postponed. Who knows, if I suddenly get the energy to try it again, I'll leave it open for me to do so. But at the moment, I want to try new things, dip my toes into different types of videos and see what works. I can't promise it'll all be Steven Universe related, because honestly, I haven't really watched Steven Universe casually in close to two years. You can thank everything wrong with for that one too. But I can promise that every single video will be one that I want to make. This probably isn't going to be what most of you wanted to hear. But hey, since when have I been in the business of just regurgitating the popular talking points? Trust me when I say that this is not only the best decision I could make for myself currently, but also for this channel. I'd hate to see the day where I was just making everything wrong with Steven Universe because my audience wanted it. I'm sure there would be some real stinkers in that batch. Now, we just wait for my brain to come up with an idea that I can actually reasonably accomplish. Yeah, that might take a while, but when we get there, I'll see you guys on the other side. <laughs>